Ooh, what's up, you crazy YouTubers? It's Mike from the Autograph Network, aka The Godfather, coming from the home office with a big recap video. Uh, I got stuff piling up on my desk. That means I haven't shown it to you guys. If you guys follow me on Instagram, Twitter, uh, Facebook forums, you guys have seen this stuff, and I do scans, but I haven't shown it to you guys on YouTube land. Um, we got TTMs and uh, I think one purchase, maybe. And uh, if you guys follow also on social networks, uh, the titans of the TTM community uh, got together last night. Uh, Autograph Weekly used to be a podcast for you guys that remember. But um, I joined in, talked to guys I haven't talked to in a long time. Zane Savage, Stacy Schaefer, uh, President Michael was there. Andy Summers jumped in. Uh, little Mr. Hardcore was on, um, uh, on chat. Uh, I believe old TTM Central Neary, uh, popped in later after I jumped off, but, uh, hopefully we can do that again. And hopefully you guys will jump in too on chat or something because it's, it was cool to talk, uh, autograph. So I, I've, I've missed that. So hopefully I'm going to do that a little more. Um, but let's get into it. This was a purchase. I find amazing stuff. And got to pick it up because this person doesn't sign. This is Tim Rose, uh, who brought to life Admiral Ekbar in Return of the Jedi. And it's got It's a Trap, Admiral Ekbar inscriptions. It is JSA authenticated, 11 out of 55. It's a 14 by 11 JSA cert. Uh, pick that up for an amazing price. Uh, the advantages of being online on social networks like Facebook because people sell stuff like that. Uh, Tim doesn't sign TTM. So awesome pickup. I think that might be my only uh, purchase. So uh, the rest are TTMs. Uh, I don't have the envelope for this because I got a poster, which I'm not going to unroll because it's huge. But this is uh, Thomas Schumberg. And he is the sculptor who created the original Rocky statue for the Rocky film, of course, uh, Philadelphia. There's a shot there, signed in silver. And there's the man, all signed in silver beautifully. Uh, he sent a huge poster, um, which is awesome. I just, I don't want to unroll it and show it. So um, I know this is coming from Dallas or North Texas. There's the envelope. I'm only going to show this one. Uh, this is James Lavelle, who, of course, was the man in the white suit, the Kennedy assassination. Uh, actually, I got a photo here. He inscribed the photo but forgot to sign it, so I'm going to send this back to him ask him if he would sign it. But uh, JFK related, the man in the white suit, handcuffed to Lee Harvey Oswald when he was assassinated. Um, I have an 8x10 but it's got the inscription made out to my ex-wife, so thought I'd get something updated. Uh, ch -ch 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 Albany, New York. Cool return here. Uh, Stephen Lang. <coughs> Excuse me, this is a shot from Gettysburg. There's like an old promo headshot of him. This is the main reason I got him. He was the bad guy in Avatar, which of course uh, Avatar is at Animal Kingdom here, so very cool. We get to experience the ride, which is phenomenal. If you guys ever go to Disney, uh, Animal Kingdom, get fast passes for Flight of the Avatar. It's mind blowing. Um, awesome, awesome, awesome ride. And there is Santa Clarita, California. Old school, ding! Nancy Kovac. She was in a lot of uh, TV shows, ding! Old school. Uh, this is my favorite, and she signed it awesome in a blue, like, metallic pen, but she was in the TV show Batman. So, very cool. Nancy Kovac. Oh, let's see. Kansas City. Oh, uh, former NFL quarterback Lynn Dickey. Played for the Packers. Awesome black and white shot. Uh, played for the Oilers. This one is very hard to see. Signed up here in blue. You can kind of see it in the reflection. There you go. This one turned out good in blue. Packers. And an old shot. 
Uh, there's Dan Hampton flying in number 99 for the Bears. But Lynn Dickey. <coughs> um, b -b -b New York, New York via venue on this one. Signed all four of my photos because uh, I usually only send three, but I print up an extra one because I forgot I had two cast photos here. But uh, Jesse Tyler Ferguson plays Mitchell in uh, Modern Family. I forgot I had this one. I changed it out because I didn't like the black. Of course, that's where he signed. Shot there and Cam and Mitch. Halloween, Batman, and Robin. Very funny show. Modern Family via venue. I don't know if that play is still going on. Uh, North Texas. Let's see what we got. Oh, uh, old school like me, you guys remember this show. <clears throat> Airwolf. Awesome helicopter. Of course, as a kid, I loved it. Uh, this is Alex Cord, man in the white suit. Another cast photo there. And uh, Ringo Kid, wanted poster. <coughs> Excuse me. Hold on. Yeah. Plug, Subway, eat fresh. Okay, Alex Cord. An awesome childhood show of mine. Air woof. Santa Clarita, California. Uh, another ding. Surprise she's signing. Christy Swanson. She was the original Buffy the Vampire Slayer in the movie for Sarah Michelle Geller. And this is what I was talking about. Ding! Playboy. Playboy cover. Christy. Schwa. Schwanson. So she has not been a good signer throughout her career. Uh, Baltimore, Maryland. Uh, sign my photos and send an extra. And former NFL kicker Matt Stover. Played for the Colts and the Ravens. Colts. Ravens, extra, sent out a card, uh, the gold.com, so very cool, thank you Matt Stover, um, found this randomly, I, this is old, This I don't know when this came back, but I got to put it away, Stuart Appleby, uh, PGA golfer, this is a 2010 Australian Masters Championship, how do I know that? He wrote it on the back. Cool golf shot there. <clears throat> and an 8x10. And he plays on the PGA Tour. So awesome. Uh, let's see here. St. Paul, Minnesota. Uh, I believe he's in the Hall of Fame. Mitch Tingletoff. Tingle Hoff, long time great with the uh, Vikings. Cool art shot. Uh, again, I love doing four by sixes because I can find cool shots like this. Uh, old school. And black and white. Sign three, three. Uh, ooh. Overseas, airmail from across the pond and. Return my money for postage. Uh, band member, and also they had a TV show, but if you guys are my age, you might remember S Club 7. This is Rachel Stevens up here by my finger. Yowza. Sign two. S Club 7 group shot. And ding. Awesome. Big crush on S Club 7, ladies. Uh, again, overseas. Very cool. Uh, if you guys are music fans, you will recognize this album cover. And of course, this is Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Heart Band from the Beatles. Uh, signed up there by Peter 
uh, Blake, who was the artist who designed it. Um, there's the man himself with the cover and some cool artwork that he did, superheroes and sign down there. So Peter Blake on that one. Overseas, uh, Miriam Mar Marleas, I believe it is. Uh, she was Harry Potter, Professor Sprout. Of course, if you guys know what the Mandrakes are, you'll recognize her from that scene. Signed one. Uh, did not return my other photos. Still very cool Harry Potter return. Uh, Miami, Florida. Came back today. Signed one of three. Uh, this is Sergey Gonchar. Longtime defensive man in the NHL. Uh, won a cup with the Pens. Signed one. Uh, North Houston, Texas. Uh, Dennis Galsblatt. Uh, he was a football player. Played with the Colts in Super Bowl three, with the number three inscription. Super Bowl three. On the cover of Life Magazine, on the cover of Sports Illustrated, signed in black up there. Or no, sorry, signed in blue. Just looks black on camera. Uh, black and white shot. And another cover of Sports Illustrated. And last one, but not least, and uh, the reason I say this last, uh, when I post stuff on... Uh, Facebook, I ask for no political comments uh, because I collect autographs. I have no political views that I express. Um, to be honest, I can't stand politics, but this is part of history. Uh, of course, every autograph expert out there, you know, oh, they're, they're auto pen. They're not auto pen. Um, could be secretarial, but you never know. Uh, they look look good from what I've seen. And again, no political comments down below. It's just a history autograph because there's less than a uh, hundred people that have held this position. But uh, former vice president of the United States, Joe Biden. Cool Joe from the GQ uh, article with the sunglasses. Of course, he was vice president under President Obama. And... I believe this is the official portrait, at least one of them. Again, you you be the judge, but of course every every autograph expert. But uh, the reason I think the real, uh, if you look at this one especially, uh, look at his certifieds, the Joe. Uh, to me, that looks good. But you never know. I could send them off to. PSA DNA or any authenticator and get them authenticated, but I'm not spending 35 bucks to do it. So I've got my opinion. Everyone is entitled to theirs. Some people just choose to express it when you don't ask for it. I just show it off to show people what I get. But uh, anyways, thanks to the guys from Autograph Weekly at a blast. Uh, I'd love to do it for longer. Um, unfortunately, I had to go to bed. So <laughs> um, that's it. Hopefully, uh, can get these put away, more stuff going out, continue the, the flow, get some purchases. Um, anyways, talk for 14 minutes about autographs. Awesome. Anyways, Mike from the Autograph Network, out.